Okay, now we're going back to the breaking news from Pretoria in South Africa. Former Paralympian Oscar Pistorius has been sentenced to six years in prison for the murder of his girlfriend, Reva Steenkamp. Judge Sokozile Masepa said mitigating circumstances, including Pistorius's disability, meant he should be given less than the prescribed minimum sentence of 15 years. Pistorius was originally found guilty of manslaughter and served nine months of a five-year sentence, but the prosecution successfully appealed the ruling last December. The accused has already served a sentence of 12 months imprisonment. He is a first offender and considering the facts of this matter, he is not likely to re-offend. The sentence that I impose will have to reflect not only that fact, but also the seriousness of the offence. It will, insofar as it is possible, have to be fair to the accused as well as to the deceased family and society at large. Mr Pistorius, please rise. <coughs> In the result, the sentence that I impose on the accused for the murder dolus eventualis of the deceased, that is Riva Stienkamp, is six years imprisonment. Siddi Bishop is in Pretoria for us now. She joins us live over the phone. Siddi, thanks for your time. Now, obviously, just hearing there about the uh, the result for Oscar Pistorius, less than the usual minimum uh, sentence of 15 years, six years. She also mentioned that public opinion does not play any role in this decision. But how do you think the public will receive this news? The public will obviously be upset by, by the finding of uh, Judge Masipa, they will be upset by the sentencing of Oscar because many in the public believe that Oscar had not shown remorse. And they believe he had not shown remorse because most of the people saw an ITV interview where Oscar was uh, crying, was emotional, but many believe it had been staged and many believe it was a PR exercise. And uh, some also believe that Judge Tokozile Masipa has a soft for Oscar Pistorius. They believe that the manner in which Riva was killed was brutal. They have seen the pictures of Riva being displayed in court. They have seen Riva's body lying in, in, a, in, in a pool of blood in a toilet, showing that the manner in which he, she died was uh, very, very cruel. And uh, many at the moment don't see why Oscar cannot serve 15 years in prison. Many believe that like any other able-bodied person, he should be in prison because he had shown his prowess in the racing course. course. He had shown his prowess in the many, many sports activities that he's been involved in. And they believe that he's also an aggressive person because there's been a history of gun shooting through the roof of the car, gun that has been released in, 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 in a restaurant. They believe that Oscar is reckless. And as Judge Masipa said, this is just public opinion. How the public feels has no bearing in court. The court will only look at the evidence. And City, you were in the court uh, for this hearing. I understand it was uh, overflowing with people. Uh, I imagine both families of Riva and Oscar Pistorius were there. What was the atmosphere like? It was a very tense atmosphere in court. They, uh, all of them, including Oscar, we have seen Oscar being emotional at times during court proceedings before, but he was relaxed today. The Sientans also seemed very relaxed, and there was no sign of shock when the verdict was passed. We don't know afterwards what they will say because we had no chance to speak to them to see what their reaction is, but it, it feels like... A, uh, they will feel like this is a slap on their faces, especially the Sienkamp. Even though they say they have forgiven Oscar, Barry Sienkamp, who has never been in court before, who came to court during uh, the, 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 the sentencing before, not the sentencing, but the, the trial after the Supreme Court's wedding, said he wanted to see Oscar pay. I do not think that this is a sentence that will satisfy him. Um, uh, um, uh, 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 mother had said she had forgiven Oscar. She had said she had forgiven Oscar because she feels like Oscar has paid his dues 
Jews, he's a disabled person, how will jail uh, bring back her daughter? But at the end of the day, we're still waiting to see if uh, both councils will appeal because uh, the, 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 the state might want to appeal this case because they may believe that 15 years is too small. I mean, uh, six years is too small. Uh, whether Oscar's uh, council will appeal or not, it, it remains to be seen. Okay, City, really appreciate your time there. City Bishop for us in Pretoria. She was in the court where Oscar Pistorius was sentenced for six years for murdering his girlfriend, Reva Steinkamp.